Hello, and welcome to my video about the best places to visit in Munich. Munich, the capital of the German state of Bavaria, is a city that is steeped in history, culture, and natural beauty. From its world-famous beer gardens to its stunning architecture and museums, there is something for everyone in this vibrant and diverse city. In this video, I will take you on a virtual tour of Munich's top attractions, sharing insider tips and recommendations along the way. Whether you are planning a visit to Munich or simply want to learn more about this fascinating city, you won't want to miss this guide to the best places in Munich. Visitors to Munich can explore stunning Baroque and Gothic architecture, stroll through sprawling gardens and parks, and immerse themselves in the city's dynamic art and music scenes. However, there is so much more to Munich than just this iconic event. From the stunning Marienplatz and Frauenkirche to the world-class museums like the Deutsches Museum and the Alte Pinakothek, there is no shortage of things to see and do in this bustling city. So join me as we explore the best places to visit in Munich and discover all that this incredible city has to offer. Number 1. Marienplatz Marienplatz is a famous public square located in the heart of Munich, Germany. It is a popular destination for tourists and locals alike, with many historical buildings, shops, and restaurants to explore. Nies Rathaus, stunning Gothic building houses the city council and the mayor's office. It features a famous glockenspiel, which performs daily at 11 a.m. and 12 p.m. Marian Sol Column stands in the center of the square and is dedicated to the Virgin Mary. It is a popular spot for taking photos and enjoying the view. St. Peter's Church is located just a few steps away from Marienplatz and features a stunning Baroque interior. You can climb to the top of the tower for a panoramic view of the city. Victualia Markt Market is located just a few minutes' walk from Marienplatz and is a great place to shop for fresh produce, flowers, and souvenirs. Overall, Marienplatz is a great place to spend a few hours exploring the history and culture of Munich. Number 2. Nymphenburg Palace Nymphenburg Palace is a beautiful Baroque palace located in Munich, Germany, and it is definitely worth a visit. Nymphenburg Palace was built in the 17th century as a summer residence for the rulers of Bavaria. It was expanded and renovated over the years and today it is a grand palace with stunning gardens and several museums. The palace is home to several museums, including the Marstall Museum, which displays the royal carriages, and the Museum of Nymphenburg Porcelain, which showcases the palace's exquisite porcelain collection. Visitors can also tour the palace's grand halls, including the Hall of Mirrors and the Gallery of Beauties. The palace gardens are extensive and beautiful, with fountains, sculptures, and several smaller buildings including the Amalienberg, a hunting lodge built in the Rococo style. Number 3. Olympia Park München Olympia Park München, located in Munich, Germany, is a fantastic place to visit with a wide range of activities and attractions. The Olympic Tower is a 291-meter tower that offers stunning views of the city. You can take the elevator to the top and enjoy panoramic views of Munich. The park is a beautiful green space that offers plenty of opportunities for walking, biking, and picnicking. You can also visit the Olympic Lake, which is popular for swimming and boating. Olympia Park München hosts a variety of events throughout the year, including concerts, sports events, and festivals. The BM2 Museum is located within the park and is dedicated to the history of the BM2 brand. It features a wide range of exhibits, including cars, motorcycles, and engines. Overall, Olympia Park München is a great place to visit for anyone interested in sports, nature, and history. Number 4. Odeonsplatz Odeonsplatz is a public square located in the heart of Munich, Germany. It is a popular tourist destination with many notable landmarks and attractions to visit. The Team Church, the Etienerkirch, is located on the west side of Odeonsplatz. It was built in the 17th century and features a stunning yellow facade. Feldern Hall Monument is located on the east side of Odeonsplatz. It was built in the 19th century to commemorate the Bavarian army and has since become a symbol of German unity. Bayerische Stadt Skansli is located on the north side of Odeonsplatz. It is the official residence of the Minister-President of Bavaria. 
Ludwigstrasse at Odeonsplatz is lined with impressive buildings and landmarks, including the University of Munich and the Bavarian State Library. Englischer Garden is one of the largest urban parks in the world and features beautiful gardens, lakes, and even a Japanese tea house. Hofgarten features a central pavilion, a fountain, and plenty of green space to relax and enjoy. Munich Residence Palace is located just a few blocks from Odeonsplatz. It was the former residence of the Bavarian monarchs. Number 5. Frauenkirche The Frauenkirche is a beautiful Lutheran church located in the heart of Munich, Germany. It is one of the city's most iconic landmarks and a must-visit destination for anyone interested in architecture, history, or religion. The church was built in the 15th century in a Gothic style, and it underwent extensive renovations in the 19th and 20th centuries. The Frauenkirche is famous for its two distinctive onion-shaped towers, which are visible from many points in the city. The interior of the church is equally impressive, with soaring vaulted ceilings, intricate stained glass windows, and a striking Baroque high altar. Visitors can climb the South Tower for a stunning view of Munich and the surrounding countryside. The Frauenkirche is open to visitors daily and admission is free. However, donations are appreciated. The church is an active place of worship, so visitors are asked to dress modestly and be respectful of those who are there to pray. Number 6. Friedensengel The Friedensengel, which translates to Angel of Peace, is a monument located in Munich, Germany. It was built in the late 19th century to commemorate the 25 years of peace following the Franco-Prussian War. The Friedensengel is surrounded by a beautiful park, the Maximilian Samlingen, which is a great place to relax and enjoy the scenery. The monument has a viewing platform at the top, which offers panoramic views of the city. You can climb up the stairs or take an elevator. There is a small museum inside the Friedensengel, which showcases the history and significance of the monument. The park around the Friedensengel often hosts events and festivals, especially during the summer months. To get to the Friedensengel, you can take public transportation, bus or tram, or walk from the city center. It is located near the Isar River and the Prinzregentenstrasse, a major street in Munich. Number 7. Rathaus Glockenspiel The Rathaus Glockenspiel is a famous clock tower located in the heart of Munich, Germany. It is one of the city's most popular tourist attractions and is definitely worth a visit. The Glockenspiel is located on the Marienplatz, which is the central square in Munich. It consists of 43 bells and 32 life-sized figures. The show lasts about 15 minutes and tells two stories. The first story is the Schafflertnens, which depicts the dance of the Coopers during the plague in 1517, to show that life goes on even in difficult times. The second story is the Ritter von der Rose, which tells the story of a knight's tournament and ends with a joust between the Knight of the Rose and his opponent. Visitors can watch the show from the Marienplatz Square or from the balcony of the nearby Café Glockenspiel, which offers a great view of the tower. In addition to the Glockenspiel, the Rathaus Glockenspiel building also houses the Munich City Council and other municipal offices. Number 8. Siegister. If you're referring to the Siegister in Munich, Germany, it's definitely worth a visit. The Siegister, also known as the Victory Gate, is a large triumphal arch located at the end of Ludwigstrasse, one of the main boulevards in Munich. Built between 1843 and 1852, the Siegester was designed to commemorate the Bavarian army's victories in the Napoleonic Wars. The gate features a central archway flanked by two smaller arches and is decorated with sculptures and reliefs depicting various military scenes and allegorical figures. Today, the Siegestor is one of Munich's most recognizable landmarks and a popular spot for visitors to take photos. It's also located in a nice area of Munich, close to many other interesting sites, such as the Englischer Garten, one of the largest urban parks in the world. Number 9. Maximilianium Maximilianium is a beautiful building located in Munich, Germany. It was built between 1857 and 1874 and is currently used as the seat of the Bavarian State Parliament. During the tour, you will be able to see the impressive staircase, the Great Hall, and the Bavarian Parliament Chamber. You will also learn about the history of the building and the role it plays in Bavarian politics.
In addition to the tour, you can also visit the Maximilianium Park, which is located just outside the building. The park is a popular spot for picnics and offers great views of the city. Overall, the Maximilianium is a must-see attraction in Munich for anyone interested in history, politics, or architecture. Number 10. Bavarian National Museum The Bavarian National Museum, Bayerisches National Museum, is located in Munich, Germany, and is home to a vast collection of art and cultural artifacts from Bavaria and beyond. If you're interested in history, art, or culture, it's definitely worth a visit. View the extensive collection of art and artifacts from the Middle Ages to the 20th century, including paintings, sculptures, furniture, and textiles. Admire the impressive collection of porcelain, which includes pieces from the famous Meissen and Nymphenburg factories. Visit the Baroque-era Hall of Mirrors, which was once used for courtly receptions and is now a popular venue for events. Explore the museum's extensive collection of musical instruments, which includes everything from medieval lutes to 20th-century electric guitars 